a lot of these patients are commonly followed up by a GPs who are not very clear about how aggressive they should yeah. be in medically treating. So there is a lot of discord in what we see in the routine clinical practices, what OMT is, and in the trials, the OMT, which they were specifically instituted with uh, achieving an LDL as low as possible. I think that's absolutely right. And I think the other thing we're very bad at doing in clinical practice, and maybe a little better in the trials, yeah. is checking the adherence correct, of our pa patients to these medications. So they may have a very long prescribed list and they may take... 30% of that risk every day, of that list every that day. List, right. um, so I think that's a real important aspect. I see with our primary care physicians that, again, there's a lot of education needed. Mm -hmm. Somehow they also still believe that the stent fixes the disease. Mm -hmm. And you have to teach them that the disease, the disease is, still, is there. still there. All the stent has done is pause uh, or improve symptoms for a brief period. It's done nothing for the actual um, lifetime yeah, course of that disease. In, in 